In today's video, we are going to be talking about the best alternatives to metformin, also known as glucophage. Metformin is a drug prescribed to people who are dealing with conditions relating to insulin resistance. This includes prediabetes, type 2 diabetes, and PCOS. But a lot of people who are prescribed metformin are not told about the long list of side effects that affect 75% of people. Some of the most common are diarrhea, fatigue, and nausea. But beyond that, it also depletes vitamin B12, vitamin B9, and other nutrients. But beyond that, it also depletes vitamin B12, vitamin B9, and other nutrients. And these nutrient deficiencies can lead to more serious consequences. Now, the point of this video is not to scare you off of metformin, but rather to inform you that there are natural alternatives that have been shown in studies to be as effective and with fewer side effects. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about these alternatives and how to know if they're right for you. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kate. I'm a certified health and nutrition coach. I post videos twice a week here on YouTube talking all things insulin resistance, weight loss, sleep, and more. So if you're ready to take control of your metabolic health, make sure to click that subscribe button. And you can also find me on TikTok and Instagram where I share new posts every single day. Now it should go without saying, but I just wanna make it very clear that you should never stop taking your prescribed medication without talking to your doctor first. And I also wanna mention that insulin resistance, prediabetes, type two diabetes, PCOS, all of these conditions are reversible. Yes, metformin and the alternatives we're gonna talk about today, they can help in this process. But if you're not making the necessary diet and lifestyle changes, these things are only gonna to help to manage the condition and they're not gonna help you to reverse it. Now I have tons of other videos on my channel about reversing insulin resistance and the associated conditions. I'm gonna link that up above for you guys and you can check it out afterwards. But before we get into the alternatives, let's quickly summarize what metformin is and what it does. Metformin, which is also sold as glucophage, is an oral prescription drug that improves how our bodies respond to insulin. And regular viewers of my channel will know, and I kind of also mentioned it at the start of this video, insulin resistance is the cause for prediabetes, type 2 diabetes, PCOS. So by improving insulin sensitivity, you're improving these diseases. Insulin is the hormone that shuttles sugar from our blood to various cells throughout the body. But when we're insulin resistant, our cells stop responding to insulin correctly, and this eventually leads to high blood sugar and a type 2 diabetes diagnosis. Metformin helps your cells to accept the glucose once again, so there isn't as much floating around in your bloodstream. For women with PCOS, metformin is also effective because the symptoms that define PCOS, which are an irregular period, high testosterone, and ovarian cysts, they are all caused by high insulin levels. Now, with all that being said, there are a few alternatives which we're about to talk about that have been shown to be as effective as metformin, also known as glucophage. And the first one is berberine, a natural compound that comes from certain plants. Some of these plants include European barberry, golden seal, oregano grape, and most well-known turmeric. So if you've heard about the benefits of turmeric for blood sugar, it's because of the berberine. But other than getting it from these foods, berberine can also be isolated into a supplement. A 2012 review that looked at 14 studies found that berberine was just as effective as metformin for the treatment of type 2 diabetes. And there is a lot of other research on berberine which has found the same. Now it should be noted that berberine has been shown to have fewer side effects than metformin, but for some people it does still cause some. Some people experience digestive distress and headaches, those are the main two. So if you've tried berberine and you've experienced side effects, then it might be worthwhile to give the second alternative a try. And that alternative is inositol. Inositol is a nutrient that is found in certain foods like citrus fruit, but the body can also synthesize it. And because the body can synthesize it, it's considered a non-essential nutrient, aka we don't have to get it through diet. An example of an essential nutrient is vitamin B12, for example. But since our bodies can make inositol, it is considered non-essential. However, 
A lot of people do not synthesize it well, and there are also certain things in our modern environment that can deplete us of it, which is why supplementing it can be beneficial. So once again, inositol helps to improve insulin sensitivity, helping to reverse insulin resistance. It improves our cells' ability to accept glucose, and it also helps our bodies to burn fat for energy more efficiently. There have been studies done on women with gestational diabetes and PCOS who saw improvements in blood sugar and other symptoms when supplementing inositol. Now, if you're wanting to try berberine or inositol, my absolute favorite brand that I recommend is So Well Health. They have berberine capsules, which are combined with chromium and cinnamon, which can also help with insulin sensitivity. And their Get So Synced capsules include two types of inositol, magnesium, vitamin B9, and vitamin D3. Again, all of these can help to play a role in regulating blood sugar and insulin. I will link both of these in the description box down below, and I do have a promo code for 10% off, which I will put down there as well. But anyways, guys, that's all I have for you today. So let me know in the comment section down below what your experience has been with metformin or glucophage. Did you experience a lot of side effects? Did you get good results? Let me know down below. Thank you again for watching this video. And if you did enjoy it, you might also enjoy my video on the most common side effects of metformin. I'm gonna link it right here. If you wanna catch up on my most recent upload, you can find it here. And if you wanna check out my coaching programs, including my seven day insulin resistance masterclass, which comes with a seven day meal plan, you can